What up, friends and family? It's your boy Mike. And your girl Bree. Hey, and we back in this thing to talk about Bad Boys 3. We just got back from seeing that. And I want to say, before we, hold on, hold on, before we get into it, please like, comment, and subscribe to the channel, man. Please do that do for that. us. <laughs> now, let's get back into it. First, I want to say, great movie. Yes. I feel like, you know, typically when you got a uh, sequel, mm -hmm. sequel is not Raven, always as good yeah. as the first. Yeah. But then to have a third movie mm -hmm. that's still good is, yeah. is rare. Yeah. And I want to say this was a good third movie. It was. The first one was good, yeah. sequel was good, and now this third one. Yeah. It fits right along with all of them. It does. I think they did a good job of kind of showing because the the other two movies were made so long ago yeah mm -hmm. i think they did a good job of kind of like jumping back in with this movie mm -hmm. you know oh, yeah so it's like you didn't really you knew what bad boys was about because yeah. you've seen the other two movies but it was like now you kind of see them like older and you know people trying to retire and all of that yeah so, so it, really it feels like so it really don't feel like it's, it's been, been gone for yeah. so long yeah yeah i think it i think they really real great job with that uh yeah. they had a great storyline mm -hmm. for the movie coming back one yeah. no bs storyline so yeah i thought it was good it kept my attention throughout the whole movie Definitely. and of course it had its funny parts just like all every of them. yeah every other one um has, so. I did catch some of the uh stunt doubles though in there <laughs> like they didn't do the little cuts super clean i seen that now yeah but it was it wasn't that many but it was a couple of them where i was like oh snap that ain't definitely ain't will smith doing that <laughs> so yeah that's the only thing really bad i really but you know they say, try their best to yeah, always find yeah, stunt absolutely. doubles that look as closely as they can to the person and i feel like so another thing martin lawrence he really ain't been in the spotlight like that mm -hmm. uh that much but i think this is like his way of yeah, getting back in yeah. there I mean, I mean, even though it's like he ain't been gone that long, cause they play right. Martin almost every day All on the TV. Time. Yeah. But big screen wise. Yeah, as in like him in a current movie, like yeah. he's still a known person in oh, yeah. the he industry. Be known. You know, I like you said though. I think it's just. It's kind of, I feel like it was kind of good to see him in something now. Yeah, definitely. You know, not just necessarily, you know, watching Martin reruns or, Cause, you know, um, the old movies or whatever. And we don't but. feel like that with Will Smith because he on social media just about yeah. every day. So he's still out there. Yeah. But Martin, like and I said, on the Breakfast Club, he trying to work to get on there. Yeah. yeah. Will still right, had a couple yeah. of movies kind of still coming out. He's still kind of in the spotlight. Because, oh. like, he just had Gemini Man come out not too long ago, you know. So mm -hmm. he's still definitely in the spotlight. But it's it was cool to see the transition. I thought that. about something else. Uh... They had one scene that it looked like they took that from straight from I Am Legend. <laughs> and if y'all seen the movie, y'all might know what I'm talking about. If y'all yeah. do, let me know down below and yeah. say I seen that. But yeah, it reminded me of I Am Legend. I yeah, was like, it was a it? good movie. I don't want to give like spoilers or anything. Are we doing spoilers or we not really. I mean, hopefully by the time y'all watch this, y'all yeah. definitely have seen the movie. So um, go ahead and do what you got to do. Spoiler alert. <laughs> I just, I really, the storyline was really good. I loved how they, like you said, that they did a good job telling the story because I almost thought in the middle of the movie, I was thinking to myself, was this girl from a past movie? Like, mm -hmm. was I supposed to remember her? Mm -hmm. You know, I was like, dang, we should watch the first two movies before I we came. I thought that same thing. But it was like they did a good job of being like no this is somebody from his past past you yeah, know what's his past past yeah and then um, i'm glad they brought old characters back yeah and not try to bring all new characters right because it Which is some I like new that characters too. but yeah. they brought the yeah. main old characters back yeah uh I like gabrielle union is not in there so if you was wondering <laughs> that she's <laughs> yeah not she in is there. not in she, there they made mention of her Yes. But she ain't in the movie. Yeah. Though, which is kind of weird to me because I was like, why won't she be at her niece's wedding? 
I didn't understand. That, yeah, like, but who knows? Yeah, I don't know. Well, maybe Martin it was just a small detail. Yeah, like maybe about. it was just a smaller detail of yeah, not guess. as close. You know, I don't um, know did a cameo or something. Maybe, but. yeah. But either way, I think they did a good job too introducing like the new people oh, at yeah, the same definitely. time as keeping the old people kind of. And the new there. people, I feel like mixing definitely, greatly, definitely greatly they mix yeah. in because well. you can feel like the tension in the beginning because you know Mike was very like I don't have a partner I don't you know mm -hmm. like in the first movie you know both of them was very like I don't do partners blah 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 you know kind of thing, but it was just like yeah eventually. Who don't do partners? I'm saying like they don't do like not partners but like outside people really. You talking about outside them. of them too? Yeah. Oh, okay. So I thought like, you were saying that like Mike Larry said no, no, no I don't no. Work like with. partnering with other people. Oh, like okay. they just only okay. work gotcha. with each other. Gotcha. Yeah. Gotcha. So gotcha. I think it was good to have like, you know, kind of show how they progress too with like mm -hmm. still being able to get help from other people, you know. Kind of thing. It was good. It yeah, was good. It, definitely it was a good storyline. And I'm glad I enjoyed it. They had all new technology and all mm -hmm. that. I mean, it's so kind of crazy cool. to see it come from. I can't remember when Bad Boys 2 came out. It had to be in early 2000s, mm -hmm. I believe. Yeah. But the first one had to come out. Was it like the 90s, maybe? I think so. I'm not 100% sure though. Or but maybe man, like late 90s. This was good though. And then I was trying I was trying to think of other movies that came out that went, got three parts to it. Like Rush Hour 3. I feel like Rush Hour 3 did not live up to Rush Hour 1 and Rush Hour 2. Right. But this right. definitely lived up to all the other two bad right. boys. So I highly recommend to go see it. If you did exactly. watch this before you went to go see go it, see. go watch it, please. Go I'm telling see. you. It's a good go movie. See. And that's all I got for this. Yeah, me too. Loved well, it. Guys, remember, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to the channel, please. But it's been your boy Mike. And your girl Bree. Hey, and we out.